And thankfully, the weather here today is calm. And in fact, Annalise, it kind of sounds like we might have a nice stretch of weather coming our way this weekend. We do. Yeah, Madison, it's going to be hard to beat heading into the weekend. So we like to see that. And today kicks it off with the quieter conditions. But we had to get through those storms yesterday. And that same storm system is still impacting parts of the U.S. Of course, the southeast was under the gun, like Madison just mentioned. But now it's moving off towards the coast. Uh, will be impacting the Carolinas. So Mississippi, Alabama, the spots that were really heavily hit yesterday, now do have some quieter weather. Where we're seeing the severe threat today, it's going to be there around the Wilmington area in particular. That's kind of where the bullseye is with a moderate risk of severe weather and still kind of watching all elements of severe there across the uh, southern coast. Now we're going to continue to watch for the cooler air behind that cold front. It's a vast difference when you compare us to what folks off to the east are seeing, and that's that warmth. Much cooler for us, 51 degrees as drier air continued to fill in overnight. And so today we're going to be running about 10 degrees below average. We should be pushing in on 70. Instead, we're going to be pushing in on 60. That makes it the coolest day uh, almost of the month. You got to go back to March 1st to have a cooler day where we topped out there around 59. But a beautiful start as we can take a look from that time lapse view in Fort Worth this morning. We did have some clouds around. Those do continue to thin out as we make our way through the morning and up to midday. We'll continue to enjoy a lot in the way of blue sky, but still some cool temperatures. Comparatively speaking, it's about 15 degrees, and even in some spots, Tyler, it's 20 degrees cooler than this time yesterday. That means that numbers are in the 40s, upper 40s to about 50 in Dallas, 48 in Fort Worth. 49 for both Denton and McKinney. Still, we've got the wind on top of that, so it does add an extra chill to the mix. Winds are sustained up to 20, 23 miles per hour, and that's a north wind, so it does make it feel quite a bit cooler. But as we move on through the day, gusts go from about 30 at this midday to about 20 or less as we get into tonight, so there will be an improvement in that regard. But even so, we're still talking about an elevated fire danger. That's especially right along I-35 and back to the west. Keep that in mind. Just a good idea to avoid burning of any kind through the day today. 60 degrees for the forecast high. Mostly sunny. Nice looking day. Cool again tonight. Have that jacket ready to go. And we are going to be seeing these nicer conditions carry on into the end of the week and into the weekend as that storm system moves on. So. If you've kind of been holding out for a car wash, I know I have, <laughs> we've got some good days finally to choose from as we head into the weekend. Really, just take your pick. We'll keep the sun going. That is until early next week. Storms return on Monday.